How do I go about starting my own publishing company? To start your own publishing company, the first thing that you would need to do is, is if you're a BMI writer or an ASCAP writer, you have to have the same affiliation, meaning you can't be a BMI writer and then have your publishing side be on ASCAP. So if you're a BMI writer, your publishing company needs to be a BMI publishing company. Now, if you plan on taking songs from other people, and some of them might not be BMI, they may be ASCAP, then you'd need to start another publishing company uh, with ASCAP and register with ASCAP. So the first part of that is you need to register a name with the Performing Rights Society. Uh, they generally, I believe, make you select three or four names, first choice down to third or fourth choice, because a lot of the names are taken already. It's really mm -hmm. the only reason they do that. So, you know, you, you need to, if you're a BMI writer, your publishing company needs to be a BMI company. If you're an ASCAP writer, you need to register the company with ASCAP. Again, it's about selecting a name, making sure the name's cleared, which means that nobody else at BMI or ASCAP has that name. Mm -hmm. And then to be totally legit, you need a, a bank account, which generally entails doing a uh, DBA, which is doing business as. It would be like Steve Kirk. DBA, Vox Music, or what's right. the name of your publishing company? Uh, Chasing Change Publishing. Chasing actually. Change Publishing. So, you know, you'd have the Chasing Change bank account on mm -hmm. or around the time that you think you're getting ready to get your first check, but you normally have to do, you know, register an official business for the mm -hmm. state, which is, to me, people say, well, do I have to incorporate? No, not really. You know, everything is pretty much going to be in your name. So that's a DBA, which is Steve Kirk doing business as, which you would register uh, with the state for that. Awesome.